So you think Billy's keeping her addicted? Yes. If it wasn't for Billy, she'd be clean? Or does she have a problem with or without Billy? That's a good question. I'd like to know that. What's today about for you? In a perfect world, what, what would you like to happen today? I want to see my daughter clean. And I'm scared for her life. She's been in the hospital twice for overdosing. And you're a police officer, correct? Yes. So this is... Yes, you you this, know that the only outcome oh, yes. here is death or jail, right? Yes. Yes. I don't want to get another call that she's overdosed or that uh, she's gone into a coma or that she has died. Well, Billy's backstage and, and says he, he's never going to break up with Jessica. And he says mother needs to back off. Let's welcome Billy. <laughs> So, Billy, are you making her drug addiction worse? No, I'm not. She had the problem before I met her. I've told her numerous times that I was tired of it. And uh, about a week ago, I gave her the option. Either put it away or I was leaving. And she chose to walk away instead of going to get the help. You, you do drugs as well? Yeah, I do. <laughs> so, I you so you telling someone to get off the drugs is... Yeah, that doesn't really help when you're high at the time. No, but it doesn't. But the fact is, okay, I'm a user. Okay. Two, two Do junkies can't live together. Okay. Listen, Vicky, what do you want to say to Billy? You, you, have your, you have your platform here? I know you've told me how much that you love her and that you're going to take care of her, but you guys go out and sell the drugs and you participate with her too. And that's not taking care of her. She's going downhill fast. Okay, you're sitting here saying this and all, but you overreact. You make things sound out worse than what they really are. Okay? She, she's overdosed I don't care twice. Any use got. Yeah, she overdosed twice. She overdosed once when I was not with her. Okay, and the last time I wasn't doing drugs when she overdosed. And if what it wasn't the for me... What happened time she overdosed when you were with her? What was, I saved her life, and she'll tell you that. If it wasn't for but me, she would have been dead. maybe you put her life in danger first. I put her life in danger first? Really? Maybe. Maybe. Doing drugs with okay, her? Okay, you're sitting here saying, I do drugs. You're calling me a junkie, that I'm a junkie? You, you, you're prescribed your medication, but you also abuse it. You take more than you need to take. Oh, I've seen you over true. my house on, on Easter Sunday. <laughs> up out your gore, excuse my language. That's not true. We're to here to on. talk about her daughter, Jessica. Right. We're, we're, we're here to we talk don't need exactly. to attack her. And I'm not attacking her. But she is making things worse than what they need to be. Okay? A junkie is a junkie. An addict is an addict. Okay? Anybody that uses... Well, what's the difference? Spelling? What? No. Yeah, difference is spelling. <laughs> I'm sorry. I ain't got nothing else to say. I'm done. Billy, come on back, Billy. I'm done. I'm done. Billy. I'm done. I'm Billy. done. I got too much going on. I'm done. Billy, come on. No, I'm done. Billy, don't I'm be done. done. This is important no, for done. you guys. It's yeah, important, important for, for you us guys. guys. But I'm not going to sit there and for her to put me down on stage. I got too much going on I right know. now. So, I have so too much. I got news so today better. that my in the hospital. I'm not going to sit here and listen to this. I'm done. Take this mic off me and all. I'm done. No, I'm done. I'm not listening to it no more. I'm, I'm going to snap. I'm done. It's better for me to get off stage and do this, please. I'm done. I'm done. I'm not going to do nothing to her. I'm sorry. I love you. You do this. Really, this is I'll a good forum for you to get it out. It, yes, this is a safe sport. environment. It is a safe environment. Okay, so why don't we just clear this air? Make it strong for everyone. We're, we're, we're trying to get help for everybody here. Yeah, we're, if, trying, we're trying to get help. Okay, but the thing is, she's going to sit there and make it sound like it's all my fault. Okay, well, I, I love will, this I, girl. Will, I won't let her make it sound I, like that. I love that. this girl with all my heart. She, she's wor and that's she's my worried best about friend. her. She's worried about her daughter's life. Your best friend. Yeah, this she's is... worried about her daughter's life. If she was worried about her daughter's life, when her daughter calls her and answers her for help, help her. Don't stray away and help somebody that's not well, your listen, daughter. Well, listen, you're not going to help her by running right now. I'm not going to listen to it. You can go back there after and you're no, no disrespect towards you. No. Nice meeting you. No, but listen. God bless. Come on there and tell her. This is a good chance. This is a day we can fix this for everybody. You do know, you, you know you need a little help. She needs a little help. She needs a little help. We all need a little help. Okay. But she's sitting here saying that I'm enabling her daughter. She'll tell you. Well, then, I've walked well, away from it. Then don't she leave before back. she has a chance to defend you. Please. Don't leave before you get a chance.
Come on, Jessica. Jessica, come on. Have a seat. And Billy, thanks for sticking around. That, that, that shows an effort that we at least want to resolve some things. <laughs> Jessica, what, tell us how bad the drug problem is. It's bad. It's bad. It's bad. Um. <laughs> and, and do you blame your mother no. for, for worrying about Billy? I, I, don't, I don't blame her for I know she's worried. I know my whole family. She's almost lost you twice, two overdose. So yes. you understand her concern. Yes, of course. And, and you understand. You just told me something. So you know how it feels. Yeah, I know. OK, so we know where we're all coming from. Right. Jessica, how bad has it got? Um, to the point that I'm still in cough and cold medicine just to get high. I mean, that's. That's ridiculous. That's insane, you know, to be sitting here sober and thinking, you know, I'm still in coughing. And you know it has to stop, right? Oh, yes. Yes. You um, have children you don't even get to see. Exactly. Um, and not just that, but it's, it's come to the point where, you know, our, our bills aren't getting paid. Um, it's, it's bad. It's bad. Uh, are you selling drugs as well? We have. We have in the past. Um, sometimes it was for legit reasons, uh, you know, in order to pay a bill or something. And then there were, hey, there were times that no, it was. There's no legitimate no, reason to, to sell drugs. Well, I mean, we. Making we man isn't going to help if you're in prison. I agreed. Yeah, and then there were times that we were selling it to get other drugs. Listen, you can never explain why you're doing it. You just say, yeah, I'm selling it. I'm yes. Just, I'm a deep Yeah. And what drugs are you struggling with? It's anything and everything. Okay. Anything and everything that comes around, I'm doing it. And what would you like to tell your mother today? Now that now you know it's not just prescription pills, it, it's deep. Yeah, it's prescription pills and more than... She just said it's anything she can get her hands on. Anything like and what? everything. Uh, cocaine, heroin. Um, you know, it's, you know, the pills. So, the, so you know right now there's no justifying the depth that it's got to. Oh, no, there's no justified. Like I was trying to say earlier, a okay. user is a user. Okay. You know, regardless if you do it on a daily basis or, you know, stop and go, but using is using. And I agree, we need help. We do need help. But for... <laughs> For her mother to sit here and say that she wants Jessica to leave me, Jessica will say the same thing. We love each other. We've been through a lot together. We've been homeless together. You know, we've been in places without power together. We have each other's back. We're the only support system that we have for each other as well, far as... May, no, may, she maybe, has. maybe as you look... What am I a support But no, as no. you system. look right now, take, take a look. He's holding her hand. Yeah. He does love her. I he know knows that. that they both have a problem. So you might have to accept the fact that he's going to be in her life, whether you like it or not, and maybe they can get help together. Yeah. 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 I mean, good. if you're admitting that, that you need help and, and not saying addict, junkie, it's, it's all the same. Yeah, it's all the same. It's all the same. How, how are you paying for heroin and what else? We've sold a lot of stuff, pawned a lot of stuff. Oh, Are you shooting it. up? Yes. Heroin and cocaine? Yes. So what's going on in your head? You, you wanted to know, you do know now. Right. I'm been in police work for so long. I'm sorry. It's all right. And seeing this tear people up, where it get 
They're on the streets. They've got no home. The families don't want anything to do with them. Well, you're your family, and you do want something to do with yes, them. Yes, I need her. I want her to get help. I want Billy to get help. But two junkies. <laughs> two junkies are not good for each other. Both of them right, listen, we, we, we've given up. you we gave you a test to see if if you were on drugs and you've you've go you've told us that you are. Yes. And and we, we gave you a test to see if you had sold drugs and you admitted that you have. So you've already admitted to to this. So when we come back, we're gonna try and save your life. We'll be right back. Next on the test, the dramatic decision that could save Jessica's life. Are you willing to go today? Yes. But will boyfriend Billy stand in her way? I'm not going nowhere. And later, did this husband cheat? I did not do it! Two weeks after his wedding? Today is the day that I'm gonna find out if you're still cheating on me, because I'm not taking it no more. Eighty-two. Do you think your girlfriend got pregnant on purpose to trap you? Do you believe she lied about being on birth control or poked holes in your condoms? Call 1-855-9-TEST-TV. That's 1-855-983-7888. Or go to thetesttv.com to share your story. The following program contains mature subject matter. Viewer discretion is advised. Welcome back to the test. So now it's time to make some decisions. Jessica and Billy, I, I asked you if you guys are ready to change your lifestyle and get off drugs and meet my friend Ken Seeley with Intervention 911. <laughs> Ken, how, how can you help these two? Yeah, Kirk and Kirk's team put together a really good treatment plan for above it all treatment up in Lake Arrowhead starting today if you accept the help. Are you willing to do it? <laughs> Jessica, are you willing to go today? Yes. You know you need it. Please. Ken, I got yeah. to say. Ken, come on. If you go, I told you I'm going to be here to support you. I'm not going nowhere. All right. Okay. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Oh. It's okay. It's okay. We're gonna get you help. This is you too. Let's get to this call. Ken, what do you have to say? How do you feel about it? Yeah, you're you're really fortunate because I don't think you have another uh, overdose in you. I think the next one's gonna be death. And you see your mom, she can't handle that. She, she cannot handle you losing you. Now, where's this place at? No. Not You're not time. going with her? Not at this time. Really? She knows she'll tell you the same story. I'm in the hospital right now, they just took me this morning. And there's nobody else but me. If you're ready, you'd get in there. You'd get in the car. It's more important. I don't care what none of you have to say. And you would do this for your. You know, you know I'm going home. And you know I'm not going to touch nothing. I'll get a drug test when you get out to prove it to when you. When I come back. When yeah, when I come back, I'll do one for you. I swear I'll do and one for you. If you fail it, you can leave. I'm leaving. You can leave. I promise. Okay. I won't fail. I love you mm -hmm. so much. We have to get in the car. We got to do this. Yeah, let's, let's get, get in the car. Let's get her there. I'll take good care of you, okay? Thank you. All right? Thank you. Jackie, how are you, how are you feeling? Relieved. relieved. Very relieved. Very relieved. I'm happy. It's good to see you happy. We'll be I... right back. Thank you. Coming up on the test, a wife desperate for the truth. If you don't pass the lot of test, it's over. It's done. What are you? And later... Two former pro wrestlers in a Twitter hacking scandal that could come to blows. Let it, let it, let it. 
Coming up this week on The Test, a boyfriend busted by his girl's BFF. I see him rubbing up and he, he, ha, ha, ha. Then he knows he's not the father. You got three other kids. She just left. Don't worry about my kids. His mom isn't even on his side. You know, damn, wow. that's your son. Plus, a double DNA drama. You think you're the father? No, I really don't. That ends in denial. That came out my face. Why are you in here? Like no. It's all this week on The Test. The following program contains mature subject matter. Viewer discretion is advised. Welcome back to the test. Our next guest, Virginia, says two weeks after walking down the aisle, her husband, Eric, walked off with another woman. Aww. Virginia says her husband was gone for four long months, and she wants to know if he spent their honeymoon having sex with another woman. Aww. Let's welcome Virginia. <laughs> so that marriage didn't last very long. But, like, when we first got married, he loved me for four months, and, you know, I was kind of confused. I was wondering, do you like... Know, do you know where he went? Yes, I know where he went. As, um, but within a month, I knew where he was because the girl called me. And she let me know that my husband was giving her oral sex. I was shocked because we just got married, and why did you do me like that? Like, why did you leave me? And what, what did you say to her? I told her, I like, you know he's married to me, so why are you sleeping with my husband? I mean, he's a married man. Get your own man. Like, why you got to sleep with my man? And you think he's cheating with other women as well? Yes, I think he cheated because I can't even trust him. I can't even trust him to go outside. I got to follow him because the still fat day. He's calling female behind my back. And we married. He said he loved me, but I don't think he loves me because if you love me, you would not do me like that. You won't treat me like that. I mean, b before, before you were even married, you, you put a warrant out for yes, his arrest. Yes, I put a warrant out for him because the film said that he stole my money and paid her phone bill. Oh. And, and, yet, and yet you still married and him. Yes, I still married him because I love him. Now, but, now, you bailed him out of jail and then went right to the courthouse and, and got I the marriage. And I dropped the charges. But also got married and right yet we then. we got married. So that was a busy day. Yes. <laughs> it, was dumb on my, it was dumb on my behalf to marry some guy like that. But If you'd known what was coming, you may not have bailed him out. I wouldn't have. I would have let him right in jail. All right, well, Eric is watching backstage, and he's ready to defend himself. Let's hope he can make it down this aisle without meeting someone along the way. <laughs> Come on out, Eric. Yeah. I did not do it! You did! She told me that you did it. You know you did it. Today is the day that I'm going to find out if you still cheating on me and you still call your ass behind my back because I'm not taking it no more. If you don't pass it out to the tent, it's over. It's yeah, whatever. done. Whatever. It's not whatever. whatever. It's done. Whatever. Whatever. It's done. Whatever. I can't take it no more. Whatever. All right, whatever. Eric, Eric, where did you go two weeks after the wedding? I went to my girlfriend's house. Mm -hmm. and why? Because of the simple fact that she went to my grandmother's house and told my grandmother that we was married. My grandmother did not know that we got married. And my she grandma... Was she was going to find out eventually, yeah, right? Yeah, she was going to find out. But I didn't want her to tell her. I wanted to tell her. That was my business. And I felt like she was wrong for going up there and telling her that was mine. But I, mean, I was not wrong, because you was my husband, I mean, and that's supposed to be good news. You moved in with another woman right yes. after that marriage. Yes. And you were having sex with this woman. Yes. But you had just gotten married. Okay, and but you still... didn't tell me that y'all had sex. You only told Whatever. me that you gave her oral sex. Anyway. No, it's anyway. not no anyway. But you, you, told, you told Virginia you only had oral sex. Okay, that was... You didn't true. tell your grandma that. No, I ain't tell my grandma that at all. No. All right. I did not tell my grandma that. Okay. Be, but all the allegations she's saying is not true. You she, did have sex she's with her. telling her mother, she said, hey, buddy, because you had that sex I had sex, sex like with this girl. You just I told me you did. Sex. I, well, I, I didn't do it. 
No, there's no way. Oh, anyway, you had oral sex. Right. right. Okay, you're done to oral sex, but nothing else. That's it. Nothing else. I saw his grandma because I wanted to get to know his people, but he didn't want me to get to know his people. I guess he tried to hide me. Like, really? Why are you hiding me for? I'm not an ugly girl just because I'm big. I'm not an ugly girl. <laughs> Next, we'll find out if Eric had sex with his ex-girlfriend since he's been married. Next on the test. Will this marriage survive the results of our lie detector test? Did you have sexual intercourse with your ex? Closed captioning provided by... To be. Are you worried your daughter is having sex for money? Does she have unexplained cash? If you want to confront your daughter and get to the truth with a lie detector, call 1 855 9 Test TV. That's 1 855 983 7888. Or go to thetesttv.com. The following program contains mature subject matter. Viewer discretion is advised. To the test. Before the break, we met Virginia and Eric. Virginia says her husband ran off with another woman two weeks after they got married, and their relationship has been tainted ever since. Eric says he loves his wife, but loves his ex girlfriend too. <laughs> did you know that? No. He you told do me now. I do now. He did not tell me that he still loved that girl. That's all I've done for him. Are you still talking to your ex? No, I'm not. I am not talking to her anymore. I believe he I'm is. I'm not talking to the girl. Yes, you are. I'm not you talking to her. You might as well tell me the truth. I'm not talking tell to her. Tell me the truth before I'm not I find out. Because if I find out, then it's all right, over. It's whatever. All right, I don't care. Well, you have a chance to come clean. I don't have nothing to say. I, I wouldn't, I don't want, I wouldn't to say. want her upset at yes, me. Yes, you do have to say. Tell me the truth. Tell me the truth. All right, our lie detector administrator asked you the following questions. Here's the first one. Since moving to Florida, have you spoken to your ex more than two times? No, I did not. You failed that. Really? Really? I did not talk to the girl. Really? I did not talk to her. I know you did. I know right, you're okay. a liar. All right, whatever. All right. Whatever. Maybe you left a hundred messages. That counts. No. Nope. All right, question number two. Since being married to Virginia, did you have sexual intercourse with your ex? You've been telling your wife that you haven't. He lied. Really? You admitted to our polygraph administrator really? that you have had sex really? with your ex. Really? Oh, you had sex with her? You You're not going to be truthful so, to me? So then we tested you on that. Since being married to Virginia, have you had sex with your ex more than two times? Your answer? I did not. So your answer was no? Yeah. You failed that as well. Really? Really? So really? You know what? Whatever. You know what? Whatever. Just f you. Whatever. you. Whatever. It's over. All right, you. Whatever. I don't care. You it's run off like a f Really? All right, you run off like a whatever. I didn't do it. So you, you came here for the truth? Yes, and I found it out. And you found and, it out? And, and, and how do you feel about that? I don't like it because he should have told me. He making me look like a fool, and I don't like it, and it's over. I ain't got nothing to say to him. It's over. So you're going to find someone who respects you? Yes, I'm going to find someone me that deserves a new you man. and your love and your passion? That's right, because I don't deserve this. I'm a good woman, and I don't deserve to be looked like a fool. He told me he had, didn't have sex with that girl, so a lot of said it's not going to lie on him, and it's over. I'm done with him. I don't want him no more. Well, good. <laughs> All right, we'll be right back. A fake Twitter account destroy a 14-year friendship? Stupid Twitter account. I don't even have a Twitter account. I do. At Kirk Fox. <laughs> Hashtag tweeting turmoil. Do you like action? Oh, look at your hand. Beyonce do a 
Well, how about that? Do you want to witness shocking results? You lied to me. If you're in the L.A. area and would like to be in the studio audience for a taping of the test, go to thetesttv.com. The following program contains mature subject matter. Viewer discretion is advised. to the test. Our next guests are a couple of wrestlers who took their fight out of the ring and onto Twitter. Curtis says his former best friend Horace made up a fake Twitter account and tried to ruin his reputation. You know, this punk made this fake Twitter account. You know what I'm saying? He want to fight on the internet? I don't play the internet games. He can come fight me in the ring. Real, straight like that. I mean, seriously, he's really, he really, really, I think he's been hit way too many times in the head of the chair to really believe that I do something like that. That's just not like it. Let's talk to Curtis first. Welcome, Curtis, to the show. How are you, Curtis? How you doing? Good. Good. So, uh, tell me why you're here today. I'm here because a punk made a fake Twitter account in my name trying to uh, impersonate me. Okay. Yeah. Uh, asking people for money, uh, saying I f Excuse me, I'm sorry. Uh, pretty much... We, we've heard the word. Yeah. Pretty much somebody I know. that I, I didn't... I said we heard it. We didn't need to hear it again. Oh, I'm sorry. Um, That's uh, all right. But um, it, 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 it's, it's a shame, you know what I'm saying? I and, rather... and this was a friend of yours? A best friend. Wow. A best friend. For a lot of years. Yeah, for a long time. And we met in the wrestling industry, you know what I'm saying? I can, I can trust him with my keys to my house. And your, ch your children, your children play together? My and... children and his children play together and, and everything, you know what I'm saying? So, so you've, lost, you've lost money, you've lost wrestling gigs? Bookings, everything, man. And it's sad. I work for one company right now. One company. That's the only company I work for in Rochester, New York, you know what I'm saying? Uh, now, you, you say that people are, are bashing you on, bashing face, me on I'm Facebook as well because of the Twitter. Because, because of this a Twitter account, this stupid Twitter account, you know what I'm saying? I don't even have a Twitter account. I do, at Kirk Fox. <laughs> oh. Oh. Okay. So you're here today because you want to find out if Horace set up this account? I want to know, because if he did, I'm ready to throw these hammers, you know what I'm saying? Well, don't throw them here. If he did, I'm ready. All right, but I don't want to get hit with a hammer or any type of tool. Oh, All right, okay. so, so why do you think it was him? Because I got an opportunity, WWE, you know, as an extra talent. You think got... it was out of jealousy? I think so, because, you know what I'm saying, we, um, we used to talk so much, and it kind of stopped. So it was kind of weird that it, our... And if you find out it wasn't him, I mean, you want this friendship back? Yeah, I mean, you I know, mean, it might not... be tough the way you, you know, you call someone a punk, you might not be able to come back from that. Yeah, he, he got tough skin, so it don't matter. I mean, you throw a hammer, he might throw a chainsaw. <laughs> I'm ready. <laughs> All right, well, Horace is here, and he's ready to put a chokehold on Curtis and his ass-backwards allegations. Welcome, Horace. Why would you feel I would do that? Why, why would you see me? Yo, why would you see yo, me feel you I would do that? came to me as a man. I man. came to you. Yo, I'm saying. Why though, would you why, feel I would do that? Why everybody pointing fingers at you? You know what I'm saying? Why you lost my supposedly you lost my phone number? You forgot how to call me? I didn't forget how to call you. You, you just forgot how to answer your phone. No, it's not. Like when that, when did the, when did this go down? Hmm? When, when did this happen? This is like a month ago. It's almost like a month ago. But you know, you know what I'm saying? All, all on Facebook, everybody talking about it. You know what I'm saying? And Everybody. who are the people that are saying it? People that don't like me or you. Listen, Horace, are you jealous of uh, Curtis's career? I made his career. Are you serious? I'm just, a I'm just asking. Seriously? Hold on, hold on, hold on. Seriously? Okay, hold on, hold on. Let's talk. Seriously? Let's hold up. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Let's talk some honest. Let's talk well, some. We're, let's we're talk we're some honest talk? facts here. Wow. When you was just a kid sitting watching shows, I was already being trained by a legend. Okay. Oh. When you made your first appearance in a ring and started training, I was already on my 25th match. Wow. By the time your name was already being known, I was on a plane flying over to the UK being well known. By the time you got your first push to your first title, I was already a three and four peat champion. I have nothing to be jealous of you about. And Hor Horace, you even pointed out this Twitter account, right? Yes, I did. You told I Curtis told you about, about it. it. I said, yo, you need to get some investigation going on this because that's impersonation. Oh, absolutely. So I'm gonna tell you to so do. So he start, you started the investigation, and it landed on you, though. Exactly. So I'm like, I'm gonna tell you to do an investigation, so I can go to jail. <laughs> I mean, I, that's yeah. what I want, right? Hey, let me make a fake Twitter account, tell Curtis to press charges, so I can go get locked up for impersonation. <laughs> Makes sense. Well, we're gonna find out today. Up next, 
is their friend Ricky, who says he feels he's stuck in the middle of Curtis and Horace's battle. Stay with us. Next on the test. The test results, even I couldn't believe. Did you create the fake Twitter account? No. The following program contains mature subject matter. Viewer discretion is advised. Welcome back. Curtis and Horace are wrestlers who are taking it to the mat over a fake Twitter account. Ricky is friends with both Curtis and Horace and says he knows for a fact Horace wouldn't make a fake Twitter page to sabotage Curtis's name. He wants them to pile drive their problems and put the feud to rest. Welcome, Ricky. What's going on, man? I can't tell you. No, just, just tell him, please. Welcome, welcome right, to the show. Please. Pleasure to meet you. What's going on, brother? So, Ricky, you, you're, you're in the middle you? of this. Yeah, you're, basically. You're friends with both of these guys. Absolutely, yeah. It's like play cousins, like, you know? Like what, brothers, what do you basically. think? What do you think's going on here? I basically He's think jealous. it's almost... He's jealous. That's what's going on. I, He's jealous. I don't well, believe... Find out. Be real, man. Be real. <laughs> I don't think Do you think, think Horace is jealous of Curtis? Absolutely I not. I mean, we don't have any reason to be jealous of, uh, of one another. Um, exactly. You're all friends. All. You're, all, you're all in the business together. Exactly. Yeah, we all help one another. I mean, where one lacks, the other one is a stronghold. So. Well, who would set up a Twitter account like that? Do you know somebody that may have done it? I, I have I an idea. I, have, I, have, I know exactly who did it. I've been telling him who did so it. So then, if you know who did it, then why you didn't holler at me? Why you didn't come to my house, man? You know where I stay? Well, he contacted me, and then that's why what is I told he contacting you, you in the first like, place? He, he should have been contacting me. You, you, you know ask... where I live. Oh my God! If you couldn't okay, get to my house, you could have came to my. You could have walked door. Something. If, if, if you don't come to your phone, why are you going to come to your door? Yeah, and, you and is the don't... Twitter account still alive? Is it still active? No, no it's deactivated. I um, shut off. How, how? It just went, it it, went uh, by Well, whoever, whoever made the account deactivated. So or, you, or know, you know who did the account? Yes, I do. And did we you tell him idea, to deactivate? Yeah. You do, too. So, yeah, so everyone, everyone knows, knows about him. Oh, my God. Yo. Okay, well, it's a because one of us on this stage has an ego, and his head is this Big would listen and shut up. No, I don't have no ego. I don't have You no don't ego. have an ego? I'm no. jealous of you? No. That's not ego ridden? So I didn't try to help you? This guy right here went to WWE with me. He drove me there. I, I, I have an ego. If one of us make it, we all make it. That's how the f I'm, I'm, you That's know what? <laughs> that's basically that's, the general that's idea. Did like, not not say that. Me. If yeah. one of us make it, we, we all make, make it. Exactly. Yeah. Hold up. I'm sorry. Am I not in a project of my own right now? That if we, if one of us make it, we all make it. That it take us all to another level. Yeah, but you haven't been talking to me about that. But I put all my business out to you, though. Oh my God. You know what I'm saying? I feel as though personally, it's outside people trying to interfere with and us. And I've been uh, saying that are, for the longest. We are. I mean, stable. you've all been friends for 14 years, right? Yeah, yeah, so, yeah roughly. I mean, you I mean, came I've on here because a couple years. Yeah, it's like this have. friendship back on yeah. track. Yeah, I mean, because I'm now. And if you three make in. it, I want in on it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Well, it's the moment of truth. Right, there you go. That's what I'm talking about. All right, listen, Thank Curtis, you. what are you going to do if you find out Horace did create this fake account? Me and him finna fight. We can take it to the ring. Straight like that. Somebody Straight like that. Some good stuff. We can take this to the ring. Hey, don't let this suit That's fool right. you. Listen, Kyle, don't let this fool you. Boy, country. look. Well, this, hmm? this isn't the Two octagon. Hits. I hit you, you hit the ground. Okay. Uh, we'll see. <laughs> I thought, I thought wrestling wasn't about punching. I thought this was L.A. Can't we all <laughs> just, just get along know. here? What's right. going on? Keep you up to get treated like know. a king. All right. Trust. Are you ready to hear the results? Let's hear them. All right, listen. Our lie detector administrator asked Horace the following question. Did you create the fake Twitter account in Curtis's wrestling name? Your answer, sir? No. You failed. You failed. Yo! 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 Oh my God! Oh my God! Yo! I'm about yo. Let's go. Yo, I'm right here. Yo, that is completely. Let's go, man. Yo, no, man. Yo, I knew. Yo. Not here. It's, that it's is okay. impossible. Come on. Impossible. 
I, I mean, you failed uh, the test. That is completely impossible. It's very possible no, because it's it not, happened. That is completely impossible. No. We went over them we questions know. like six crazy. times. Yeah, I know. Each time, no. I, this, that is completely that's impossible. You, man. That is completely impossible. Jealousy, man. It's not jealousy because I did not create that account. It no. can't, this can't cheat a test. Listen, I'll no. tell you this. Wait, wait. Let me talk now. Yesterday, you had taken even some countermeasures, so we had to redo the test today. They said I tried no, to countermeasure the machine. And, and I said, I don't know what that is. Well, countermeasures are when you try and do things purposely to throw the test off, to make it invalid. Uh, okay. Wait, whoa, 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 whoa. So, so wait, I'm still, I'm still talking. And, and then today we retested it, and, this, and you failed. That is completely impossible. No, I don't want it to sit is. down right now because it I'm about is. to put it's these in. I mean, it's, 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 it's really impossible. No, because like, the, told me, the guy told me, he said, do you know who made the account? I said, yes, I do know who made the account. He said, well, that's probably why he said, because when I asked you the question, he said, you kind of seemed excited. I said, yeah, I was excited so because... So if you know who made the account... You made the account. I did not make the account. It just told you right here, bro. That is way impossible for me to have failed this test. <laughs> First of all, I brought you here to prove that I didn't. Well, a lot of people bring people here well, because true. they think they can beat the test. I didn't right. think I can. I didn't think Thank I can you. beat the test because Thank you can't you. beat a test with hey, truth. You need That's to prove impossible. to me, my I would friend. I love to be tested because I know I did not do that. You, I, I think he needs Matter to take. You need to make a public apology to me. I can't yeah. apologize. Well, listen, That's real. That's real. That's real. I can't listen, guys, for something no, I didn't no. do. Yo, right. see, this we'll is, right you right know, right. this messed up my career, man. Coming up on the test. Now's your chance to just get on it. Man up, man up, man up, man up. Oh, wow, man. Answers. The following program contains mature subject matter. Viewer discretion is advised. All right, well, Curtis, you came here. You wanted to know who set up that fake Twitter account. Now I know. And now you know. And Horace, this is a chance for you to maybe explain. No, I, I can't. Know. I can't explain that. That says I failed. Oh, you I, did fail. And everybody was pointing fingers at you, too, though. I this know, is a chance to be honest. Is, the, I can't be, I'm not gonna sit up here and take the blame for something I honestly truly didn't do. I really can't. Now this expecting, now I know why I'm not getting bookings. Mm. Oh, wow, man. Let me say something. Maybe now's the chance to just get honest. Wait, you, I know you say you can't, but maybe you dig I, deep and just tell like him. Like I said, may, I maybe it, may, listen, man up, man up, man up, wait. man up, wow. man up, man up, man up. Man up. Here's what I think happened. Here's what I think happened. I think maybe you set up this account. You didn't know it would get so out of hand. Maybe it started out as a joke at first. You know what? Wait, I think you hit no, it. No, listen. Right wait, there. I think you wait, hit it. Listen. I, and now he's trying to... Hang yeah. on. Listen, I think it just got a little deeper than you thought. Feelings started getting hurt. You were already in. You've, you sent out the tweets. They got retweeted. You told him, hey, you better check this out. Someone's tweeting about you. You were trying to deflect the stuff that was coming towards you. And everybody you. talking about me, though? And now it's time. Like, I think you're telling my... me now it's time to come. Ruin my right, character. Ruin my no. image. Here's the I'm truth for the matter. Here's, what else is on, here, the, on here's the, the truth, here's the truth, here's the truth for the matter. I didn't make the account. When I was talking to the examiner, when he examined me, he well, said... Well, take me to his house. Maybe you told him to make the account. All right, well, you better work harder to convince him because he thinks you Yo, did it. Yo, when we get back he home... He thinks you did it now. <laughs> you better prove your friendship to me, for yeah. real. I never... For real. Yeah. Yeah. Some DM, right. for real. Well, you got Do the you answer. Do you really know that? You, can, you, you came on this? the test, you needed an answer, you, you got it. I got it. I now got now it. it's up now to you guys to find a way to move forward or just end it. I know who's my friend. Maybe you got to find a way to get your own bookings. All right? man. Check out what's happening next time on The Test. Coming up tomorrow, a boyfriend busted by his girl's BFF. I see him rubbing up. You know what? I'm done with you. Then, taxi cab confessions. Was this somebody you met in the cab? Yeah, customer. Oh. So the tip was included. All new test. That's tomorrow. Well, if you have somebody in your life that you don't trust or you want to put to the test, go to thetesttv.com. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time. Goodbye.
accident, don't wait. Call 8. Today on Trisha. This woman's son passed away unexpectedly. I lost my only son, Troy, who was the love of my life. And up until his last breath, he denied having fathered 19 month old Asami. Tara said she was. Troy said she wasn't. Tara was claiming that Troy accepted Asani as his daughter. My son never lied to me. You heard what your son said. You heard what I said. Yeah, yeah, yeah. His mother fears Asani's mother is only after one thing her son's settlement money. All of this is a lie Trish. about her and my son. You didn't love my church. Please go Please speak. Let the DNA test that test. Now this woman is battling his girlfriend and his mom. Can psychic Mary Ochino bring these battling families closer to the truth? He's around you all the time. You have to know this. I didn't feel chaos. I just felt so much love from him and the family. This DNA test could ignite a powder keg. This is a picture of 32-year-old man named Troy before his untimely death. Now, backstage is Tara, who's here today to prove to Troy's grieving mother, Pam, and his long-term girlfriend, Keita, that he is the father of her 19-month-old daughter, Usani. You see, Pam and Keita claim Troy... Yeah, but Pam and Keita claim Troy never believed he was the father, and his dying wish was to have a DNA test. So listen...